everyone, I'm Sophia with Awaken Catholic, and this is Awaken the Saint. Joseph Puchala was born on the same day of his birth in 1911. When he was old enough to enter seminary, he began his studies in Lviv, which is now known as modern-day Ukraine. Nicknamed Achilles during his time in Franciscan formation, he said his vows in 1932 and officially became a priest in 1936. He began his priesthood in the Franciscan convents in Grodno and Vinitz, but was short-lived when the Nazis began to devastate and lay waste to Poland during the Second World War. It wouldn't be long before the newly ordained priest would have to put his faith to the ultimate test. He was then called to serve in local parishes where there quickly became a shortage of priests. The clergy had started disappearing left and right, either from imprisonment or fleeing persecution altogether. But Joseph knew this wasn't a time to flee, even though he had the perfect opportunity to do so one night. He knew that God was calling him to serve the church, no matter the outcome. He remained with his parishioners, and it wouldn't be long after that that he was captured by the Nazis. He, along with St. Carol Herman, were brutally tortured and eventually killed by the Gestapo in 1943. Horrendous deeds were done to those servants of God, but yet they never renounced their faith or lost hope in the Lord through their trials. There were a total of 108 martyrs recorded during the World War, where countless men and women laid down their lives for the sake of the church. Each one of them, including Blessed Joseph, knew that their lives were at stake just by associating with the Catholic Church during this time. But yet they continued strong in the faith, even choosing to stay in the trenches against the enemy and Satan himself. St. John Paul II, a fellow Polish native and victim to the devastation and death of the Great World War, was able to beatify Joseph, along with the other 107 martyrs of World War II in 1999. What constantly inspires me in my own faith is the courage of so many martyrs who have happily laid down their lives for the sake of the church. Some were given the mercy of quick deaths, and some were given slow, painful martyrdoms. These are the martyrs that I try to put myself in their shoes. Renouncing the church would not have spared Joseph or Carl's lives. They were going to die at the hands of the Gestapo at any moment once they were captured. What always amazes and encourages me is that these men didn't even renounce the Lord in their hearts through all of their torments. Some days may seem like the worst day possible when everything's gone wrong and everyone seems to always be getting the upper hand on us, but it's in those moments that we can call upon the comfort of the Lord like Blessed Joseph and surrender all our pain and suffering at the foot of the cross. Blessed Joseph Achilles Pachala, pray for us. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Saint. Awaken the Saint is a three minute daily show that unpacks the lives of the saints with practical messages for everyday life.